What is up, heroes? This is Minite Zero, and welcome back to Let's Play Celeste Blind. In the last episode, we uh, we made it through the hotel again, and we had quite a good time. Despite it being so long, I actually played decently well. And hopefully in this episode, when we make our way through Chapter 4, again, hopefully, the ridge, or the Golden Ridge, um, I guess that continues. So we got the Golden Feather Mix. Alright, I'm down. So right off the bat, we're going to have to be pretty quick with that one. That was still not quite quick enough, but you know, that's all good. Alright, so I'm, I'm starting to get the, the feel already for what kind of a level this is going to be. Wow, I got to really hold off on that. Oops. I should have been looking ahead, not where I was. What? Uh, I looked like I fell through the platform there. I'm sure if I watched that in slow-mo, there'd be something off. No, it's probably just me being rusty with the game again. Realistically speaking. It's uh, significantly more likely. Cool. Wow, this is such a... This is such a chill background song. I'm, I'm digging the remake so far. Ah, oh, that's right. That's what I'm supposed to do. Oof. Wait a minute. Oh, I probably have to... I see. I have to get all the way over there to replenish my, uh, my dash, I think. Okay. Because I need my dash for that. Cool. Onward we go. Ooh, we gotta we gotta direct the blocks now. Ah! Ah, darn it. All right, let's see if we can at least scout a little bit. Oh, we're moving. We're moving. Wow, we actually <laughs> made it pretty far, all things considered. It's gonna be pretty tough to uh, direct the block through that. Down, up. Okay, down, up. All right, down. Keep going, keep going. That should be good. Now we got to get over fast, up, presumably. Oh, I didn't make it in time. No. Oh, that was actually really close. It's good to know that I don't need to direct the block at that point. Okay. Oh, I didn't do it. Darn it. I didn't alter it. I don't know what happened there, but... Onward we go. Okay, up, down. All right. Wait, what? Aw, oh, man. So close, yet so far. All right, I'd say we're doing uh, pretty well so far. What? Ah. Oh. I spoke way too soon. <laughs> Rather, a second too soon. Uh, definitely was playing that a little bit close to the right edge of the block, but that's okay. Alright. Doing pretty well. There we go. Oh, wait, no! <laughs> I was focusing on it too much. I didn't, well, I guess play like as quickly as I could have at that part. No! That's okay, though. I feel like that was a pretty close call. Alright. Oh, what? What did I have to do there? Oh, I thought it was on... I thought it, it was just going to be on track normally from what it was already on track for beforehand, but I guess not. What? Ah, <sighs> That's alright. This definitely falls under like super chill music rather than like the super hype stressful music that accompanies a lot of more difficult uh, platforming segments in games typically. Okay. Go, go, go! Oh, man. 
I spent too much time just focusing on the platform and where it was and whether or not it'd be at the right height. Darn it. It's just a bit off. Sometimes if you're like just barely off, it'll kind of like nudge into the right place. But sometimes it seems to be like just outside that, that comfortable range where you can. Like that. Okay. Oh man. Oh, I keep. For some reason, I feel like I uh, I perceive that as being much lower than it is, or something. Because when I actually was like dying, <laughs> and then uh, took a look at it, it was very different from what I had, what I'd been thinking in my mind. Because I kind of like set the block on the on the course, and then I don't really pay attention after that as I'm already kind of moving on to the next obstacle I need to get over. Really? <sighs> so yeah, if anything, there's more leeway on the, like, top of the block. Because the little, like, switch part on top goes up and down based on whether or not Madeline is actually on it. But in terms of, like, the bottom, it's uh, a little bit more strict. Really? I didn't think that was that off, but I mean, I'm sure you guys, you guys are able to look at the whole screen probably, whereas I'm focusing a little bit more on Madeline and uh, not able to take the time to look at things as much. All right, that should be good. What? I thought that would be good. I guess not. Okay. Let's see if it's good just as is. It is, so I didn't need to do anything. Of course. All right, well, we made it over anyways. So moving on. Huh. Am I able to get over this? Not easily, that's for sure. I probably, oh yeah. <laughs> This is going to be a tough one. No, I don't think I can get on the other side of it either. Hmm. Oh no, I was on the wrong side. I tried to get like ahead of it because I thought that would be what I needed to do in the end. But um, nope, I was wrong. That's for sure. Otherwise, I don't think this obstacle is actually uh, that crazy difficult. Wait, why did I go up again? I'm trying to go diagonal upright. Was that too fast? Yeah, that's definitely too fast. I need to go, I need to hold back a little bit. There we go. Oh, man. Okay, yeah, I think I need to go even a little bit slower. The further this thing is ahead, the better it seems. But not too far ahead, I guess. That should be good. There we go. Yeah, I definitely need to just hold back a little bit. Oh, man, we got the wind again. Oof. Oh no! <laughs> I did not react to that in time. And, uh, well, you saw how it turned out. Okay. Oh no, now the wind's blowing the other way! Alright, well, we'll see what we can do. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so. I see what I need to do. <sighs> that, for the record, was not what I needed to do. <laughs> hmm. There we go. Do I need to dash there then too? I mean, it seems like it, right? If that didn't make it on its own. Oh, 
I see, I have to utilize the wind there. Makes sense, makes sense. Oh, I went way too far to the right there. <laughs> I got ahead of myself, trying to kind of speed demon through it. All right. What do we have here? We get a nice little preview of the climb, which is quite the climb, holy cow. All right, so how do we want to do this? Let's plan. So we need to bring this block up, and we can probably direct it to the right or left. Or can we? we cl I don't think we can, actually. We cling onto it, we ride up, then we wall jump off, then we cling back on, then we wall jump off, bounce up, cling, and then cling back onto it. And then, probably need to get on the other side? Or no, I can cling onto it as it goes up there. Although I need a lot of stamina to do so. I think I should try, yeah, getting on the other side of it, on the left side of it, transition here. If I can get ahead of it, I can get on the left side. And then, I may need to save my dash. Eh, looks like I might be able to jump off of it into that, and then we get up there, climb, okay, and then it's pretty much over. All right, let's, uh, let's give it a go. All that platforming, or not platforming planning to oh I said I was gonna try to get on the other side of it there but it's moving pretty quickly I don't think that's uh, gonna happen although something interesting oh I think I need to actually oh yeah you know what I bet I do yeah cuz I can totally do that all right let's try this there we go now I'm up here, I cling. Oh wait, what? No! <laughs> okay, so I need to transition again at that point. So if I'm on the left, I'm in the clear there. And then it shifts. So I need to get on the other side? No, actually, if I'm just on the right side here, it should be fine. But then I need to save my dash, probably, if I want to uh, get on the other side. So how could I do this? I boing up there, on the right, and then... I can't cling on the right. I need to be on the left there. And I don't think I'd be able to get ahead of it. So I'd probably dash, cling, and then... Let's see if I can climb over... Like, jump over it at this point. Because if not, then I need to re rework my strategy. So let's try that. Darn it. All right, let's try boing it over. We can! Uh-oh, uh-oh. But we lost uh, quite a bit of stamina there. So we gotta figure out how to work the stamina then, too. I wonder, does the spring reset our stamina? Hmm, I think so. If so, we definitely need to utilize it. I wonder if I can try to like jump ahead of it there, so I maintain my dash. So I do something like that. Yeah, I think that will be a better strategy, because that way I maintain my dash going forward. And back over. Oh, man. So, huh. How do I... I have to probably be like really tight with my uh, with my clinging and my jumping. How else can I get my stamina back? Because <clears throat> there's no flat point ever. Maybe if I just <clears throat> keep jumping or something like that? I don't know. I definitely need to jump there. This is proving pretty tough. Because of the stamina limitations, which is not an obstacle I foresaw. Hmm. Because I can try to use my dash at that point to climb further up on the moving block. To, like, postpone my fall, per se. 
like that, but it's not going to do a whole lot. Hmm. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do it? It just seems like I don't have enough stamina. I know you guys had said in the past that jumping uses more stamina than just climbing, so maybe that's the uh, takeaway here? Oh, wait, no, the spring is an absolute must, because I ran out of stamina way earlier there. So that pretty much confirms that... Oh, really? How did I... I, like, climbed up. Just, like, straight up that time. I'm at a bit of a loss. I know I get like a little bit of a boost when I jump off of this because of how it's moving, which is pretty cool, but otherwise... Do you guys see that? Like, before I died, I did one jump, like, up the, uh, the wall there, which was really helpful. But I don't know if that's, like, a one-time thing. I think so. Probably. Huh. I know that I see these little like pockets on the side. I think they're red herrings. I don't think I can actually like do much with them. Huh. I did not expect to be able to uh what's it called? Hang on to the wall there. I thought I was going to die, but I survived. Much to my chagrin. What a word. Okay, interesting. So it seems that last jump to get on the other side is kind of what, what does me in. Yeah. So maybe I can do this with one jump fewer? I don't know. If I end up on the left side... I don't know. That was pretty close, but I pretty much, that also kind of, now that I realize that, I pretty much need to end on the, the top right side. It also makes it seem like I don't want to be waiting at all at any time, so I really want to delay that trampoline. Let the block be as high up as it possibly can be when I uh, use that. Because that way I'll get the maximum like time out of the stamina, like I'm not spending any time just waiting. Really? I feel like I'm getting close at that point. Yeah, I need to hang on for as long as possible. Because whenever I do that last jump, that's what puts me over. So I hang on, hang on, and then jump. And then 
then I'm gonna be over the limit. So the longer I wait to do that jump, the better. Wow, I can't even believe that just happened. I tried to fall off. I tried to fall off, guys, <laughs> and dash over, but it didn't happen. I was like waiting for the red to happen too, and I was, and it just wasn't coming. But for there, it did. Yeah, I feel like I just need to be more efficient with my jumps or something. I don't know. That was that was good. Oh, I should not have done that. <laughs> Alright. If I'm just, like, really clean and efficient with my jumps, I should be okay. If I don't have to climb much at all after my second wall jump back onto the block, I think I'll be okay. But I have to this time, so I don't know. It's not looking very good. It's like when I jump back onto the left side of it. If I approximate it well, not like that. <laughs> I'll be okay, but... But if I have to climb up the block, that's kind of what I think is going to put me over the, le the, uh, the limit. There we go. Oh, and that time I went too far to the right. I think I waited too long. Oh, that's too much. Even then, I'm still timing that poorly. The thing is, the the sooner I jump, the earlier I kind of like break in break my stamina, which is obviously not good because the earlier that happens, the uh, the more I fall. Woo! All right, we made it. I was gonna say I should get to the next screen before I uh, say I made it. All right. We got a few key cards to get, and we've got a spring that's moving and grooving. Um, I've got an idea. Let's see what we can do. Oh, I shouldn't have wavered there. Oof. Almost made it there. I just didn't react in time. What? Why did I? How did I? Did I really get that second lock? I feel like. Okay. No! Oh man, and I had my dash too. I just wasn't ready to use it. Ah. Why didn't I just take it slow? Patience. Oh what? Come on! Woof! That was a that was a close call. Almost got very upset with myself. What time is it? How long have I been recording? I don't think. I don't think it's been too long. Forgot to uh, start up the timer, which is not a good thing. How am I gonna? I think I have an idea of how this is gonna work. Let's see here. Ooh. Oh, I see, I see. I didn't have the time to uh, really think about what was coming next, but... But now it's all coming together. Oh, man! At least I have this kind of a uh, backup strategy. No, and I kept holding up! I was like, at the end. It's alright, I don't think this part is too egregiously difficult. Famous last words, right? <laughs> 
Wait, what? Seriously? Why wasn't I holding right? Come on! Uh... And I already started holding to the left. Okay, okay, I'm getting to that impatient... Uh, or that impatient, like... Alright, I just... I know I can do the challenge, it's just like the final, like, easiest part that I'm messing up. What? I was... I hit dash! Uh... And then, obviously, not taking my time, not being patient, and... Screwing up all the other parts. There we go. Okay, and we got ourselves another checkpoint too. Wow, this wind is intense. And that was not how it's supposed to work. Oh man, I tried to hit up left, but to no avail. What? I, I'm pretty sure I hit the wall there, and I was holding R2, um, which is my my shoulder button for grabbing the wall. But that's okay. Huh. It was like the same thing there. I think it actually has to be Madeline needs to be facing the wall for her to grab it. Because, like, look at that. Did you see that? Multiple times in a row. Oh, wait, that that time it worked? How does that work? Ooh, man, that was, whew, that was a little too close for comfort. All right, so now we got these platforms. Huh. Okay, what we're gonna do is aim for while they're up there. Okay. Ooh, this is this is cool. I like that. Oh man, nice. We are in the clear. Uh oh. Uh oh. What have I gotten myself into? <laughs> Dang, that 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 comes up on you a lot more quickly than it looks. All right, so we got a lot of moving blocks coming up ahead. Oh, really? Still too far to the left? Still? How am I? Why do I keep misjudging that? Oh. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, man, I felt like I almost had that. That's, that's a really cool setup at the end, though. The platforms you're using to make it through end up becoming somewhat of an obstacle that you need to maneuver around while still obviously utilizing because, well, you have to. Oh man, I tried to, I tried to grasp on to uh, the bottom one. I tried to let go there, but it did not work. Oh really? Ah oh, man, what I want to do is activate this middle one, then the top one, and then I can like, seriously? I just want to fall onto the middle one there. I'm not trying to like, make some massive jump or something. Just trying to fall. Almost, almost. Okay. Oh man, and then I tried to jump off of the bottom one, and I just jumped right into the middle one. Oh man. See that? Did you see that? I swear I was outside of the block there. I should not have been rebounded and knocked down by that one there. Uh, and I, there's, yeah. Okay, I do have to wait. I've gotta wait. I'm getting impatient. Great. Whew. Okay, we made it. We're not quite at the end just yet, but that's okay. 
So we've got this cloud thing. We need to move. We need to jump up, get on top of this block, move it over to the left so we can ride this block up. And it looks like I can move it to the left and right. So I'm going to have to navigate it to the left, hop on the wall there, then hop back on the block, navigate it to the right, guide it through this central area, jump up on the cloud, bounce up, cling back onto it, jump over on top of it, potentially, yeah. And then, oh, as soon as I can, I basically jump on this cloud, get up there, get up to this cloud, get up there, move this block out of the way so that it stays in the center. It pretty much stays in the center the whole time after this uh, after this initial jump to the left. And then I need to ride it all the way to the top. Okay. How quickly is it going to come back? Oh, what? Really? Alright, to the left, to the left. Okay. Oh, man. What? That was weird, but um, I guess that's okay. Aw, oh, man. I already screwed it up. It's alright. We can wait. To the left, to the left, to the left. Alright, and then to the right, to the right, to the right, to the right. Oh, man, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Yeah, and I definitely need to jump on it there. What's kind of nice is that after the initial, after I like reline it to the center, I don't need to worry about actually moving the block at all. Okay. Over to the right, to the right, okay. Up, no, no! Aw, oh, man. Really? Wait, huh? Oh, that's right, I need to make my way up here. All right. Yeah, I'm having a tough time with that, uh, that block there. Or that cloud there. Oh, that's, come on. And why did I do that? Wait, why didn't I... Alright. Come on. What? That was not fast enough. Nope. Mess that up again. <clears throat> and mess that up now. <laughs> Oh man, the negativity is overwhelming. And mess that up again. Alright, here we go. No, and I missed the cloud! <laughs> that was like the quickest I've done it. I just jumped right over the cloud over this way cloud oh wait no I'm supposed to go up I'm supposed to go up oh I went back I like tried to jump back onto the platform just like I don't know out of like some muscle memory I have I knew I planned ahead of time I knew I had to go to the left I didn't land on the side of the platform there, I landed back on top of it. Oh, that's not fast enough. Let's just practice this little quick. Okay. So that's good to know. I basically just need to uh, 
land on this, and if I get this jump right, I'll immediately grab onto, I'll like land on this platform, land on this cloud if I get it right. And then I just need to do that and I'll be home free. All right, let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. Okay. Lovely. I feel like that's the most frustrating. It's like when you're just trying to like jump onto the side of a platform from on top of the platform, because it feels like such a simple task. And it's something like, you're like, I know I should be able to do this. I know I should. Oh, I messed it up. Come on. <laughs> you guys saw me practicing it over and over. <laughs> over and over. And then like three times in a row, I didn't do it. Why? Because I got impatient. My, I didn't wait long for the cloud to come up long enough, or far enough, rather. Wow. Wow! I got the cloud jump, and then missed the block, something I didn't do in any of my practice runs. Nope, that was not it. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I shouldn't have to use my dash in the middle there. I'm surprised the block made it there. Oh, I waited too long! I tried to get like that maximal cloud jump and um, well, you guys saw what happened. Okay. Oh, that is, oh, that was way too close for comfort. Way too close for comfort. I saw it at the end. I was like, you better not be, uh, you better not be giving out on me. Uh, all right. What do we have going on here? Ooh, interesting. That's a kind of a tough one. And over. Another checkpoint. We've got to be getting pretty close. What? Did the wind just like suddenly stop there? Oh, that's right. It's going to be one of those levels where it resumes. And I'm sure that if I'm not doing this in the proper timing, I'm not going to be able to uh, do the level as intended. Whoa, that was not ideal. No! I need to get more height off that. The thing is, like, these cloud things are so annoying because you have to wait to get, like, the maximum height out of them if you want to get that height out of them. Uh-oh. What if I wait? It's gonna blow to the right now, right? Yeah. Okay. What do we have here? All right, we got these pink clouds. Those are, those are the ones that disappear, right? After you use them once. Wow. Long passage. So we need to not, intentionally not get the big jump off of this first pink cloud, jump over, dash onto this one, not get the big jump again, dash onto that one, get the big jump, fall over, dash onto that, get the big jump, go over, fall, and then dash to the right, then dash to the right and up left immediately. So I land on the wall, can jump over that, not get the big jump, <laughs> dash to the right, not land on it, not get the big jump, dash to the right, not get the big jump, 
and land on that and then get a big jump over and then not fall on those spikes. Wow. This seems like it's going to be a pretty tough segment. Because as you can see, now I'm trying not to get the uh, the big jump from them and that is proving to be... Oh, I shouldn't have used my dash. Proving to be a little bit of a different challenge compared to the rooms up until this point. I basically gotta jump as soon as I land on them if I want that to be the case. Oh man. You have to be really careful with where you're standing because they will launch you in a uh, wherever direction your, your character is pointing. And I did not get the maximum height out of that jump because I need to conserve my dash, not use it in order to get over. There we go. Over and then jump, dash, jump, dash. Big jump. Oh, we were so close. The crazy part is I could have used my dash there. Like I could have used it. It would have been A-OK -okay if I used my dash there. Didn't get max jump. I feel like that's gonna be one of the harder parts because some of these later parts are actually not seem to be that crazy difficult. It's more about just kind of like trying to jump as soon as you land on the platform rather than trying to get, you know, a full... Not really having the time to think about it per se, right? You just jump over, jump over, and then we're good. Okay. Huh. So this looks kind of difficult. Oh, interesting. The uh, the entrance to the room closes up after you leave it. Oh, come on, further to the right. I swear I was holding up left, but it's not but enough at least I'm holding up left game don't be doing this to me I'm gonna go crazy and that was just a bad death there we go although what do I do there huh how am I gonna get that one I've like got to jump to the right, I think, and then up, and then fall back down to the left, but I'm really gonna have to space that well. Like, that's really tight spacing. Yep. Oh no, and I went too far to the left. That is not the problem I expected to have with that segment. I had a minute to think there, and I did not take it, and I regret it. I don't know what's happening. Um. Oh my. That wind surprised me. I was like, wait a minute, what do I do now? I'm gonna die. And then all of a sudden the wind was like, don't worry, man. I got you. All right, I guess, uh, oof, that did not work well. I think I need to, um, yeah, do like a wall jump like that. Oh man. Oh, that was not a good idea because I need my dash there. Uh, I should have. Oh, I wonder if I could actually make it all the way over there just out of curiosity. I can. That's kind of funny. Why did I. Why did I. Why do I keep using my dash like that? I gotta conserve the dash. Conserve it. This game and these this is not the uh, the main game. This these are the B sides, Nick. They're gonna make you use every resource you have in just the way you need to, not all willy nilly. So I can't react and like panic use my dash to stabilize myself in the air. I need to know exactly what I'm doing. And just like last time, <laughs> I wasted my dash there. <laughs> There we go. Aw, oh, really? 
I don't think I actually need to use my dash there. I think it might be easier to land on that platform, actually, if I don't. So let's try not doing that. <sighs> oh man. Should have been holding up right. Okay. Oh, I just like flew off it so quickly. <laughs> this wind is strong. I think it's the first time I've died in, on this room, or in this room, uh, that way. Really now? Why does that keep happening? Come on, Nick. I'm just gonna be you. What? You can't just like stop like that. No! No! Wind! Wind! Save me! Whew. Okay, that was. <laughs> that was a roller coaster. I love this B side music here. So. Hmm. I'm definitely gonna need to dash between these platforms. So. Well, I, I should really just look at the. Uh, the visor here and take a look. So I dash onto this, I dash to the pink one, then I dash up to the blue one, then I jump up there, dash wall cling, get my dash back, wall jump, dash onto that thing, dash to the right, get on that platform, dash to the right to cling to that wall, and get my dash back again, and then I just fall with good timing. I actually don't think this room is that difficult. Famous last words. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> As I said, famous last words. Aw, oh, really? Aw, oh, man, you really... You, like, really cannot air drift much at all. Darn. Okay, a little breather. No! <laughs> I messed up was probably the easier part of this. I think that was a, that was a decent save there. Oh no, I missed it! I missed it! I thought I fell at the right time, but uh, I was mistaken. There we go. Alright, the Golden Feather. We've defeated Chapter 4's B-Side. Whew! It's a pretty good one. It's a pretty good one. Overall, I feel pretty good about it. Despite all the negativity, it's been a, it's been a long month been a long day. Not feeling super hot, which is part of why I made an effort to play Celeste. But, um, this is certainly, certainly a fun experience. Oh, I, I put my controller down again and it started vibrating. That probably sounded weird on the mic. Um, okay. So we've completed Chapter 4's B-side. There's still 5, 6, and 7. And then there's a whole Chapter 8 that has some strawberries, I hear and a B side, and then there are C sides, and then there's also a chapter nine, so there's still, there's a lot of Celeste to be played. I'm, I'm actually quite shocked, but nevertheless, the platforming has been plenty of fun, so I am, I am looking forward to it. Next up is the Mirror Temple. Huh, should be, should be a good time, but till the next episode, this is Moon Knight Zero, and this mission is complete. <laughs>